Welcome to Auto Motor Reviews. Today, we delve into one of the most anticipated developments in Indian defense aviation, the HAL Tejas MK2, set to reshape the IAF's combat capability in 2025 and beyond. An evolution of the Tejas MK1A, the Tejas MK2 is not just an upgrade, it's a leap toward a fully indigenous medium-weight multi-role fighter that brings India closer to self-reliance in military aviation. Design and Performance Enhancements The HAL Tejas MK2 comes with a significant increase in size, weight, and payload capacity. It boasts a maximum takeoff weight of 17.5 tons, enabling it to carry more fuel and weapons than its predecessor. With a length of 14.6 meters and a wingspan of 8.5 meters, the MK2 has a stronger airframe and refined aerodynamics, featuring diverterless supersonic intakes, DSI and canards for better agility. It's powered by the GEF-414 engine, delivering over 98 knots of thrust, ensuring superior performance in both air-to-air -air and ground attack missions. Avionics and Combat Capability The MK-2 is equipped with cutting-edge avionics, an AESA radar, an advanced electronic warfare suite, infrared search and track, IRSD, and a glass cockpit featuring wide-area displays. These features enhance situational awareness and survivability in high-threat environments. The aircraft will support a wide array of Indian and foreign-origin weapons, including Astra air-to-air -air missiles and precision-guided munitions, giving it a formidable multi-role punch. Strategically, the Tejas MK-2 is crucial in phasing out older IAF platforms like the Mirage 2000 and Jaguar, aligning with India's vision of indigenous defense capability. With the prototype expected to take flight in 2025 and production beginning soon after, the IAF has plans to induct over 100 units. Backed by DRDO and HAL, the Tejas MK2 represents not just a fighter jet, but a national milestone in aerospace innovation. Stay tuned to Automotor Reviews for the latest on India's defense tech, aerospace advancements, and global military developments.